Hi, I'm Matthew. Um, today I'm going to demonstrate a new method how to detect a sniff on your network, but this time there is no uh, modification, no change or configuration to any switch. Uh, to just show you that I actually configured my switch that it has the IP, uh, the MAC address of my machine. Uh, it's got the actual address table size of one and oh, this is much better and the port security is enabled so there's no messing about uh, um, I can't add any additional static entries or fake ones whatever whatever this is just how a normal switch would be configured uh, in those terms so also, as usual, I got the Windows host as a virtual machine connected to my network. Um, now, as usual, I'm going to start action 8. That will help me to detect the sniffers. Uh, that's my default gateway. I'm going to start it now. As you can see, it starts it. So it gave some feedback, as usual. Um, now I'm going to activate uh, my new uh, promised sniffer, the advanced one. Well, the one one is my default gateway, one to six is my IP address, and this is my MAC address as well. So, yeah, that's going to start, and as you can see, the advanced promised sniffer is working and operational. Um, now on the Windows host, just to show you that uh, the internet is working, there's no denial of service, no such things here, just works fine. Um, now, uh, when I just start a sniffer, let's use Kane and Abel for that purpose. I'm going to just start the sniffer, and in a few seconds of time, uh, I should witness that um, if I just go here oh yeah it's, it started already uh, 129 and 129 is apparently this host yes it's this host it's sending some requests to Defi Gateway where when he thinks it's actually uh, me while it's not me and you can see the IP addresses is trying to connect to uh, so they are here uh, for example I can try to click on different sites but it's still trying to connect, connect and has no clue what's going on um, we can also make it a bit a little bit more efficient we've given it uh, IP forward option. So now, hope now, hopefully it will work. Yes. So when you will enable IP forwarding, um, the actual attacker uh, might become the victim because now he will not notice what's going on. He's he'll start sniffing, using art poison, etc., etc., and his internet connection will still be there. Well, I'll be detecting that what and be able to see what sites he's visiting and what is he doing on the actual PC. So I can I'm actually um, I'm actually now performing a very strange version of a man uh, a man in the middle attack. It's a very strange thing because I'm protecting my network and here the attacker wants to sniff around and he will be attacked by himself if he'll go and try to access his uh, credentials uh, or what credentials his email or whatever and enter passwords I can actually sniff that if I would be nasty and <laughs> so this is quite strange but it just shows you uh, that it's actually possible uh, to uh, detect a sniff uh, without any modifications of the switch and this is what I really like today and I was thinking about it at work and it 
apparently when I came back home and tested it, it works, it does the job, so I'm really happy. Um, uh, what else can I show you? It detects that someone's in the sniffer and shows me the site where he's visiting. Awesome. I think it's just awesome. So I need to make the, the, the documentation now. Um, so I wish you a good night and hopefully you enjoyed this demonstration. Bye!